Drive down University Avenue in St. Paul on a rainy day, and you'll likely see water draining off building roofs and alleys and into storm sewers. The runoff can result in street flooding and cause environmental problems. That's because the water often carries sediment, oil, and other contaminants to the Mississippi River. But an innovative tree trench project along the Central Corridor Light Rail Transit System, currently under construction, will reduce some of that flooding and pollution. Eight miles of permeable pavers on each side of University Avenue in St. Paul will act like a sponge, soaking up some of the runoff. In a two and a half inch rainfall event, the system is designed to collect three acre feet of runoff from the entire system. And, and is that a lot? That's a pretty substantial amount. That's uh, three feet of water over one acre. And what happens to the runoff pollutants that end up in the tree trenches? This unique infiltration system captures pollutants and over time, microorganisms break them down. We can never go back to the way it was, but we're starting to take small steps to put the water back in the ground the way it used to, it used to be treated. While the use of tree trenches isn't new in urban development projects, what sets us apart from others is that it's the longest stormwater tree trench project used in a light rail system, attracting considerable attention from other cities planning similar projects.